So this one we've got to, um, we've got to win. Obviously the one before it said come top five. Now most people would have gone ahead and probably won that. But it did say fifth, so I did fifth. Now I've done all of these special events and I'm pretty sure that say if I'd have gone ahead and won that, these opponents would be set against the speed I did winning it. Whereas where I came fifth, I think they're still going to be slow, so it's going to be easy to win. seems to be totally different today, it seems to be really easy to drive this. It seems like it's now got a bit of balance and stuff to it, which it didn't have before. Oops. And I, don't, I know that they can alter these cars with a little hot fix that they put out before in these series when a car's been running particularly bad. And the next day, you, like, you know, there's loads of complaints. And the next day you go and do it, suddenly things are all quite nice on it. I'll stay in here for a little minute. I'll stay third and then I'll get... How far is that leader? I don't really want to beat that leader at all, obviously, the last lap. While I've still got him in my sights, so I'll just stay here in third. Unless he starts getting a bit too far away, then I'll have to overtake this one in second. But the idea is anyway that I'll stay here until the last lap. light on the back of that car matches the uh, is that a number or is that a light it matches the paintwork that's oh, number two looks like a number eight on the back there be very interesting to sort of if any of you struggle with this one saying that your your opponents were going a lot lot faster than mine 